already didn't know. Okay, Katie, welcome. Thank you. I this is Kat Miller, and for anyone that's listening to us here, and I am going to do a file session, an emotional freedom file session with Katie, and Katie has requested some files to help calm the mind and get more insight for meditation and such. And so we're going to do that. First of all, Katie, what I want to do is I want you to say issues at hand and look for a number. And this is my way of doing a SUDS level, uh, which is subjective units of distress. Put your index fingers uh, under your eyes, close your eyes, and say, calming the mind. Calming the mind. Look for a number. This is, go ahead. Three. A three. Okay, mm -hmm. so at this point you're in fairly good shape with it. And um, you can go ahead and take your fingers off and open your eyes. Now, we're going to look, and we may see that number increase as we actually begin mm -hmm. to look at the focuses that we're wanting to clear to get to that calm mind. This, this is a combination of files that I recommend for increasing the inclination toward meditation because meditation does help to calm the mind and then for a calm and peaceful mind. So, I want you to take the emotional freedom vial and I want to place it on your chest, yeah, just anywhere on your chest, in the middle is easy. You put your left hand over the vial, as Katie has done here, and then I'm going to have you call these files. I'll just give you keywords for the files and have you do those, and then we'll run the vial. We do up to four vials or files at one time. First one, screaming baby. Screaming baby. Presentations. Presentations. Passive modifications. Passive modifications. White chestnut. White chestnut. And that passive modifications, white chestnut, is what we're calling with it, just so you understand that. Okay. Taking responsibility. Taking responsibility. That's four files now, so I want you to put your right hand over your left hand, close your eyes, and take ten deep breaths in and out. And so what I wanted to let you know while she's taking her breath is that the reason she puts her left hand over to begin with is in order to begin to draw the information. Your left hand is your receiving hand. So we're drawing the information into her energy field from the files that are linked to the emotional freedom file that she is running. And then the right hand goes on top of the left hand to complete, make kind of a biofeedback loop to really enhance the bringing of the information from the files into the energy or into her energy center. So, let me know when you're done with the ten breaths, and then we're going to look for a suds level or subjective units of distress level again. And I found that the go ahead, close your eyes, look for a number. Let me know when you have it. Issues at hand. Issues at hand. And issues at hand is just my way of saying everything that we're working on right now. And so you may see a number, feel a number, or a number just comes into your mind. Mm -hmm. And let me know what you have. You have something there? I do. What? Six. A six. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now when the number is above four, I mm -hmm. prefer to run breaths, the number of breaths, one more time to let the body begin to adjust to that stuff. And so let's go ahead and put the vial back on your chest. Left hand over, right hand over left. Close your eyes and six deep breaths in and out. Now, another thing that, oh, that just, that thought just left. <laughs> this, this just is, besides opening up the energy, it's also giving you a little bit of time to relax while you're doing this and that can really make a difference when you get yourself into a calm and relaxed spot. The files are named according to the type of things that are in there. And Screaming Baby, which was the first one I had her run, is one that addresses not only a child but an adult. When you feel like you want to scream, you may be attached to something from your history as a child. Let's do issues at hand again. Issues at hand. And what number do we see? Anything? One. Okay, so let's go on to the next set. We do four files at a time. Go ahead and pick up the vial. Left hand over the vial, flat across the chest, and I'll talk about that in a minute. 
and let's do four more files. Chakra balancing. Chakra balancing. Increasing energy flow. Increasing energy flow. Quieting your inner critic. Quieting your inner critic. Enhancing meditation. Enhancing meditation. Right hand over left hand. Close your eyes. Ten deep breaths in and out. The flat hand across the vial is showing the body that you want it to read what's in the vial. Now if you put that vial in your fist and put it on your chest, it's like you're trying to hide it from your body. Because usually when you put something in your fist, you're hiding it. So a flat hand is opening you want the body to see what it is that you're putting there. So that's why the left hand is open like that. One of the files we just called was quieting your inner critic. That is that voice inside your head that tells you that you're wrong about something that you're doing and whatever. And it refers to you as you. And so it's almost like it's an external voice coming in and telling you that you're wrong. So uh, quieting your inner critic is about relaxing, letting ego let go, and uh, quit criticizing yourself. Okay, let's do issues at hand again. Issues at hand. Zero. Awesome. Now when I hit a, a zero, mm -hmm. I will usually go ahead and do the last four files that I always recommend that you do at any uh, emotional freedom file session because it just leaves you in a really calm, relaxed mm -hmm. state. So go ahead and put the vial back on your chest, left hand over it. And these files are inner child, inner child, inner light, inner light, I am, I am, and I feel, I feel. Go ahead and put your right hand over your left, close your eyes and take the 10 deep breaths in and out. And as these files actually came to me, the inner child and the inner light were the first two that came. And I had a chiropractor that was working with my vials and doing a lot of work who said that he went out to lunch with somebody and when she ran those two files, she just felt so relaxed and calm. She said it's far beyond what you would get from the deep, easy breaths, what she was feeling. And I thought, I need to then... Uh, put those in the every file session that we do and then when I am and I feel came up then we uh, added those in because it just seemed natural. I am is a very powerful creative phrase and this file has in it all kinds of things like I am strong, I am independent, I am love, all kinds of things like that, pages and pages of I am statements that help to create what you want to be. Okay, let's do issues at hand one more time. Issues at hand. And zero. How do you feel? Good. You feel a lot different than you did before we started the session? Do you feel calm? Awesome. Mm -hmm. Joe? <laughs> So isn't that cool? That it, I feel at peace. 